This is Coon Cassis for Eiffel TV and Associates from Macklin's Rimar Bar. Sorry, mate. Go on, that's all right. Again, mate. Okay, yeah. Should I have to make me? Yeah. Oh, man. Take care, mate. Okay. With me, I've got Scott Quigg. Scott, um, he must be bitterly and gutted. Uh, yeah, devastated. Devastated. Can you sum me up into words? Okay, is it? So, yeah. Is don't know yet. Uh, How do you feel right now? Absolutely good. Um, just trying to just, yeah, devastated. Um, how did you think you started the fight? I thought, first, especially first, first three rounds, I, I, was, I was well. Well happy with how it started. Um, then it was the fourth round. I thought I was having my best round, and then you can't move it up. I was starting to put a bit more pressure on, and you can't move. Uh, my fourth round was my, my best round, so fine then. Just right at the end of the fourth round, you can't move an uppercut, and did my jaw um, right at the end. So. That put a bit of spanner in the work. You know, I, I felt like I was starting to get a bit into my groove you know, through the fourth round, but then the fifth round, I took the round off because I, I thought I need to. This was numb. I didn't know it, it, how painful it was going to be if I was to get hit on it. So, fifth round, I, had, I was pretty, very cautious, let him hit me on my gloves a bit just to see what. The reaction when it, it didn't hurt, so I thought, right, just start now trying to go back into the thing and slow me down a touch. But I thought the middle rounds, you were saying, uh, that's where I, 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 he probably got the better a bit. But that, but from eight, nine, ten, eleven, I, I felt like I was well in my groove, and I thought. Because Joe come back, Joe said, Sky, have you six one down or something? I said, you what? Because I felt comfortable in the. I felt like I wasn't getting it. I felt like I could see everything he was doing. Um, and then, so I had to start putting the, he said, yeah, you're going to have to start going, dude. You're obviously not scoring them for you. So, but then, I, I felt like I was wearing him down and especially in round 11 I thought I'd, I've got I've got him going there so I come out in the tour thinking I'll, I'll finish him and I, in a way I come out too too eager and he, he had a very good round so he, he, he got the last round but just <laughs> devastated it was always going to be like I said one of you do was a 50-50 fight um, between the two of you, so it was always gonna. The thing, the, the thing is honestly, the, the first, the first six rounds is whatever you like. You know what I mean? It was like a game of chess. Yeah. Do you know? So I wasn't getting it. He, he might have looked a bit busy, but I was catching everything, and I felt comfortable in that. So it, I, there was no panic. You know, there was no panic. Thing. I thought I'm seeing everything. I, I thought it was easy. And it was just, there was no panic in the corner. And then until we heard what Sky was scoring the fight, that's when John, right, we're going to have to start thing you know, because like, I didn't think I was, you know, losing, losing the fight. I thought it was close. But then as the front range was going up, we was going to start um, picking it up. But I thought I'd already nicked a couple of the early rounds, just through not getting it and doing what I was doing. But because it seemed to obviously two of the judges had scored them all for him. Um, one of the judges seen it my way. You know, so they've seen it the way I was, you know, I was blocking, wasn't getting it. But again, I'm not going to take anything away from him. It was uh, a good fight. He's a, he's a world-class fighter, but I want to, you know, 100% believe you know, I, can, I can beat him. You had that 11th round where you caught him and hurt him. Yep. Uh, did you feel that that was a possible round where you could have stopped him? Uh, well, no, he survived, didn't he? You know, I, I, went to, I, I went to get him out of there and I didn't get him out of there, so 
no, he, he'd obviously did what he had to do and to be fair, he, he didn't really want to engage up close, you know, he was the one I was putting it on him in the end, he was holding, you know, small, like, you know, coming in, grabbing and good tactics by him, you know, the ref, he got away with it, the ref didn't pull him on it, you know, the ref did come in to beforehand and give a bit of a big speech and I thought he's going to, you know, be a strict one here and, but, he, he did what he had to do, he smothered the shots, he, he held and he, he got away with it, so... Like I said, I'm not going to discredit what he did, I, he, he's won the fight. Um, I thought he could have gone either way, because of the, the, the first... i say the first six rounds, it's whatever you like. But, it's... I'm not going to... I'll, I'll be back. Do you feel like you need to take some time out now? You've got a broken jaw as well. Oh, um, and I'm keeping you talking as well. It's... You know, I, 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 we meet... Listen, I'm putting on a bit of a brave face here. I'm absolutely gutted. Do you know I want to be... If it was up to me, I'll be back in the gym Monday morning trying to improve and get better. Do you know, it's just... It's, my jaw might make me have a bit of a... I have to have a bit of a rest, but hopefully a bit of ice will fix it, but I doubt it. <laughs> Alright, listen, Scott, thanks for talking to uh, IFL TV. We want your night tonight, and like I said, I can see you, you're devastated, so just <laughs> back to square one. Mm -hmm. But thank you for everyone who showed the support for me. Um, just greatly appreciated everyone who's come to the arena tonight to support me and to support him and made a great atmosphere whether you you know they're supporting him, supporting me. You know, that's what made the night special as well. Scott Quigg, thank you very much for talking to Arfield TV and uh, we'll talk to you soon. Thank you. Alright, cheers.